Welcome to Dependable Flame, where we explore vintage petrol lighters, ashtrays, tobacchiana, and other useful mechanisms. Make yourself at home. Today we have a vintage Mill Flam Bob automatic petrol lighter advertising eight years old Grant Scotch whiskey. It's a very cool old lighter that's in very good condition. It does not appear to have been used. The wick looks brand new. There's uh, no residue in the snuffer cap, things like that. This lighter was featured in an earlier video that you probably saw uh, here in the last couple weeks about what does it mean when we call a lighter unstruck. This lighter has definitely been struck. I sparked it in the other video, but it has not been lit so far as I can tell. It does show scuffs, scratches, dings, and at least one dent right here in the front. It's not the worst thing you've ever seen, but it's definitely a dent. Scratches. scuffs, that sort of thing. It doesn't appear to have lost any paint that I can see, but there are scratches to that portion of the lighter. This is what I would call a slipcase lighter. It has a cross-hatched engine turn design there on the slip case you can see it is marked mill flam bob made in western germany you don't see that western germany very often usually it's just west germany at least in my experience. You can see the mechanism snaps open and sparks as it should. You can see the wick. Not sure what it is with those mill flam wicks but both of the lighters that I had had that blue dye in them seen that in other lighters at times as well I was never a fan of scotch myself got into uh, uncles one time when I was I don't know probably somewhere in the neighborhood of 11 or 12 years old when I thought I was getting a big swig of root beer and it was a big shot of Chivas Regal. So my Scotch career ended before it ever began. I could never, it just tasted like Listerine to me. I've been told you can acquire a taste for it. But I won't be doing so. really cool with these Mill Flam Bob lighters is they come with a brush hidden inside the case. It's marked 1000 Zunder which you've seen or I have seen I assume you have. These lighters on eBay marked that way or listed that way so I don't know what the difference was I don't know if the Bob was a later designation for the same model or really what the deal was 
but clearly the case of the lighter is not labeled 1000s under probably just a difference in model or um, as I said a later model of the same light or something like that would be my guess maybe somebody can correct me there in the comments so that all fits nice and neat and you have your brush in there to brush away any flint dust or soot whatever build up you get in your mechanism or your file wheel should have gone ahead and taken a look while I had it open and show you well the entire insert it's not been slid in and out of there a lot you can see a few marks dent there so you have the normal scuff scratches from going in and out of the insert but like I said not like it has been used on a regular basis it looked to me when I made that other video like yeah and it still does to me look like this tip has been ground into an oblong but it's hard to see so anyway the mechanism the flint you know all goes in and out as I said the lighter appears to have been unused the flint tube was obstructed when I acquired the lighter I cleared the tube and replaced the flint and it does spark sparks well sparks as it was intended and should it is just ready for someone to fuel it up by applying some petrol fuel right there into the insert in that slot and get this brush back in there so we don't get things in a bind and once it's fueled it will be ready to go really nice engine turn design does have some um, blemishes or corrosion just a few spots there that you can see not in quite as good a condition as its partner that I already sold was but it is a very nice lighter that will function very well for somebody who uh, needs to, a lighter to put in their pocket to uh, have it the ready at any moment or uh, you know maybe you collect whiskey advertising Maybe you just collect old German automatic lighters. Any way around it. This one is worthy of your collection. Until next time.